Hey guys, it's you. Welcome to a, another MLB Perfect Inning Live video. Today we've got episode 2 of Draft Champions. Now, I did mess up a little bit, but here's the deal. So, we had our all-star draft pick. We'll cut to that. And with it, we get Steven Vogt. And you just saw I got Steven Vogt. Now, I forgot to record a 70-plus player of the month poll, which was Adam Wainwright, and then a 65-plus player. Uh, season best pull, which was Marcus Stroman. So now that those two are out of the way, we wanted to make the draft a little bit better. I'm playing the Lab CMD, by the way. Link to his channel is in the description. Uh, but we wanted to make the draft better. So we spiced it up. We had three good players. Unfortunately, two of them are starting pitchers for me. Fortunately, though, the third one is a catcher. So now the remaining 22 picks will have... 12 experienced scouts and 10 rookie scouts. And we're jumping right into it. Great. A uh, pretty good start. I think we're going to go. Yeah, we're going to get Odubel Herrera. Uh, solidify the middle. Great catcher. Solid center fielder. Our next pick. Um. You know, we'll go, we'll go Carlos Beltran. Uh, he's a good hitter against lefties, and he can either DH or be a viable bench option or even a corner outfielder. So two picks, and not, not too hype, but could be a lot worse. All right, here's our first week round. We'll get Ricky Weeks because he can play third, or sorry, first and left. He can also come off the bench. His hitting stats are the best of those three. All right, another great pick, Corey Dickerson. Granted, he's another corner outfielder. We're starting to get heavy on outfielders early, but at 60 overall, you just don't pass that up. All right, we get our first relief pitcher, Hector Rondon. Only two pitches, unfortunately, but very good velocity. Best pick of the three. Our next pick, we're going to get Mike Miner. Good pitch variety. 57 overall. Nice velocity. Plus, now we've got a lefty out of the bullpen. All right. We got Miguel Cabrera. Um, yeah, we're getting Miguel Cabrera. He's just, just, I'm sorry, too good to pass up. We really don't need a good starting pitcher. Um, we're gonna go Ulyaski Guriel. This might, this might backfire, but I like the bat. All right, we'll get Chris Young. We really don't need any more good outfielders, but it's just like, really hard to pass up some of these guys. So we're at 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we're at 12 players. We got three picks left. Yeah, you know what? We're going Danny Duffy. I can re if I, if I win and get to keep my players, I can resell them. Uh, all right, Brad Miller, absolutely. Uh, because we need a middle infielder. He's a 59 overall. He's a middle infielder. He'll be on the team one way or another. And with our last... Yeah, we're getting Jed Lowry. There we go. We solidify our middle infield. And we're at 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 players. Now we got 10 rookie scouts to end it off.
I'm going to get Contos. I like his pitch selection. Uh, I still do have two spart starter spots, but I'm going to consider those. Sorry, yeah. I'm going to consider those like bailout picks. All right, we're taking O. We got our closer. Pretty expensive, honestly. But we need the best players we can get. Um, you know what, let's absorb Manaya into our bullpen. He's got 74 velocity. Ooh, Nelson Cruz. That's not a great card, though. Leclerc? Yeah, we're getting Leclerc. That's our last bullpen arm. We only have one lefty out of the bullpen, but that was a really good pull. I think we're going to have to get the catcher brown. That's that's just a complete waste pick. But such is the draft. Now we get a pick. We're going to have to go Hanley. Um, I'm sure we'll be able to use him somewhere. We're going to get Overton. Get our reliever. Or sorry, starter. If we get one more starter, then we only need batters. We can specify that. You know what? Trey Mancini? That's a really nice card. It's another outfielder, but it, he can play first. He can DH. I do have middle infielders. This is like a... This is a terrible round. We're going to take, yeah, we're going to take J.D. Martinez because he can throw the ball. And now we only need a starting pitcher, unfortunately, so we're going to specify that, take Aaron Blair. That's it for the draft. We'll be back with the roster Alrighty, we've built our team. Quick check, we're at 55 overall. We can do a... Yeah, we can do team deck. And team deck keep, keeps us at 55 overall, but there's our pitching staff. We've got Wainwright, Stroman, and Duffy, a strong top three. In the bullpen, we've got Leclerc, Rondon, Miner, and O, and even Contos. Batting, very strong starting lineup with Herrera, Miller Vogt, Mancini Cabrera, Beltran is our weakest at 52, Dickerson, Guriel, Lowry, then our bench is trash. We've got Brown and Martinez who are going to do nothing. Then we've got Weeks and Ramirez, and then we got Chris Young who's basically our one substitute hitter. If you guys enjoyed the Draft Champions concept and like this new style, smash the like button, comment that I'm an idiot because I messed up recording the drafts of Wainwright and Strowman. Subscribe if you're new for more MLB Perfect Inning Live content. Uh, but I'm G. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, which should be tomorrow for the gameplay of this Draft Champions, where I will put... Uh, you know what? I'll put Adam Wainwright on the line because he's worth $2 million. He's worth more than my entire roster from last time. So Adam Wainwright on the line if I lose on my channel. Uh, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, and as always, peace out.